Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. It's late and if you're wondering, no, you're not seeing a ghost. I know I haven't uploaded for a while now. I've been busy with a couple of career things. I'm back today because I got access to the comment browser from Perplexity and it's super exciting because it's the latest and greatest thing in the AI space that's building up hype. A lot of people are demanding access to the comment browser and for some reason I got access to it and I got an invite. If you want an invite, make sure you follow me on X. I'm trying to give out the invites that i get to people who are subscribed to me so make sure you subscribe and follow me on x it's down in the description below you know tweet at me ask me for a access link and if i have one i'll send one over to you but what is the deal with this browser cursor for everything imagine you have that for everything for your emails for trying to find the best restaurant for trying to find the best light maybe reading over documents maybe reading over your leases your contracts your divorce papers your severance packages maybe even your layoff documents so one of the exciting things I saw being done is someone actually created a sentiment analysis on Wall Street bets stocks and asked Plexity Comet to send it report on the most talked about stocks on a daily basis. So we can go ahead and click on assistant right here. So I want to compose a daily report on the most talked about stocks on Wall Street bets and I want to see that every day at 9 30 a.m est so i'll send it over it's scheduling a daily 9 a.m eastern reminder to send wall street bets stock reports sweet so it basically compiled the email and then i'll just click send you are now set to receive a daily report on the most talked about stocks from wall street bets so as you can see right here this is the first report um or the, the general structure of what the report is going to look like it just sent me it it says here's your daily wall street bets stock report for today and the most discussed stocks are these stocks and what's cool is you can cancel everything directly and tell it to actually cancel the reminder and the daily emails please as you can see the scheduling it's going to delete it off of my schedule so it will no longer send me anything so one of the cooler things about perplexity's browser is it no longer uses google search natively so the issue with google search natively is sometimes you're bombarded with sponsored ad so if i'm on google and i search for best vibe coding platform and i search for it the first four to three results are going to be just straight up ads it's not going to be a result sentiment or analysis or anything right it's just going to be like ads even if i search for something like the best coffee machine look how many sponsors there is like all of this is sponsored content it's major slop so if you search for things on complexity for example so let's do so if we search for the best coffee machines we get some important articles we get a basically summaries from ai with reviews like some points fast heat up it gives you like temperature control maybe the prices generally it's just much more refreshing to see than whatever the hell this is so i can tell it to open up five different tabs of different news websites for me it's going to open up cnn fox news for example wall street journal maybe the new york times and the reuters let's just say we want to open up these tabs and then i'll ask it group my tabs together and please close my google gmail i want to group the tabs together and then i want to remove my gmail tab so it's going to look at the tabs and then it's going to go ahead and group them together and then it's going to remove the gmail so i just told it that i want twitch and youtube to be on a separate tab or separate grouping so as you can see it just grouped all these things together let's take some news and i'm going to choose a piece of news that is not controversial because i don't want this to turn into a political debate so i want to take a look at the five news tabs and research for me what each one one thinks about the new Trump law that was passed that allowed people to invest their 401ks into private equity markets. When necessary, the Comet browser will control your browser and click through things and research. Um, and when it's not necessarily, it can do its research on the back. As you can see, we have a Comet Assistant at the bottom that is currently controlling my browser. When it's being controlled by Comet Assistant, your browser will have like a blue outline around it. Okay, so we're done with the report that took a bit of time but i'm just going to simply ask it to send me the report as an email it gives up this file where it gives you the option to send it as an email you can cc it for example and then you can send it out here is the email and it was sent to both of these emails and here's the detailed summary and generally what it looks like i don't like the formatting i would much rather just read it off of what it was telling me but yeah that's it for the video today thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video this was so exciting to use i'm so excited about agentic browsers and 
and this is obviously one of the better ones and i really enjoyed using it if you want an invite once again follow me on x.com i have a link to that down in the description you know tweet at me asking for one and i might be able to send you one if i have some i don't think i have right now i actually let me check for you real quick okay i don't have any invites but hopefully i'll get some and i can send them out appreciate you all enjoy i'll see you guys next time be safe be well